no idea. I said, man, like, she just got $100,000 from USDA, and you got a product. We ain't got a product. Hmm. I said, you, need, you need Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Like, you, you need to. <laughs> but that's, that's where I come in um, at is because I, I get straight to the point. Where's the money? Where is the money? I need you on my team. Yeah, where is the money? Yeah. Um, Cause I know y'all got it, you know. <laughs> so where is it? And what we, we need to do to get a big settlement for the black farmers? Yeah. Right? So a couple billion. No, two point two exactly. Teach me the game. So this is what they did before they made that announcement um, about a year and a half ago. They had um, people to go to like the black farmers and say, hey. Was you ever discriminated against? But it had to be before 2019. Absolutely. You know, so before you 2019. Against it? <laughs> <laughs> so can we just, can we just get the reparations? Um, but if you had a farm or you was trying to have a farm before 2019, um, and you filled out the paperwork, but this thing, paperwork was 100 page long. <laughs> So, you know us, for one, we ain't trying to read. For two... <laughs> That's a lot of paperwork. <laughs> That's a lot of paperwork. Somebody filled it out. Somebody filled it out. Yeah, no, no, a lot of out. people filled it out. So, what they ended up having to do was hire people to go sit with these old farmers, old black farmers, that's like, I don't want the government in my business anyway, to go line by... What's your name, sir? Uh, what's your date of birth? Uh, what's your story? Uh, when, when was you discriminated against? Uh, who did it? Somebody made a bunch of money filling out the paper. <laughs> Listen. <laughs> that was a whole nother gig. Uh, yeah, that was a whole. Listen. Um, Listen. Y'all ready? Yeah. Yeah, we ready. We're ready. You ready? <laughs> All right, well, let's get started then. Welcome <laughs> back to the Black <laughs> Now, we have a lot of guests here on the Black Market, but we got some very special guests with us today. Now, correct me if I'm wrong. This is one of the youngest farmers in America or Georgia? Both. Georgia and the nation. Well, since Georgia's in America, yeah, yeah. one of the youngest farmers yeah. in the whole nation. Yeah. Now I'm sitting here reading all the credits. This is amazing. We got a whole child <laughs> prodigy in here with us today, Miss Kendall Ray Johnson. woo woo to the black market. <laughs> and you got your mom with you today, yeah. Miss Ursula Johnson. Yeah. Then we got pops behind the scenes. Yeah. Mr. Quentin Johnson. You know, we, team. we got the Johnson family in here Johnson. with us today, man. <laughs> on the black market. How y'all doing? We good, man. We good. We 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 trying to get, you know, Miss Kendall to um get her products together and um actually start teaching other kids how to become young farmers or in the um young agriculturalists and get in that agriculture, you know, game. Kendra, how, did, how did all this start? <laughs> so, this started when I was a three years old. My great grandma. Three years old? Yeah. <laughs> it all started when I was three. It just, it evolved started when I was three. Mm. <laughs> like, so, my great grandma, Kate, taught me the coffee story, which is, take the top of a you you eat you you normally eat the top of the collard green and and throw the bottom away. But what she did, she took the collard green base and put it back in the ground, and and it started regrowing. And I thought, I thought that was really magical that it was just growing like that. Hmm. It might be magical. Yeah. But then you just took it to a whole nother level. Yeah, I took it to a whole nother level. So I. <laughs> So I took all the seeds that I could find in the house and put and planted on our patio porch. And we had, <laughs> believe it or not. Oh gosh, <laughs> <laughs> that's a <our> pun. <laughs> okay, I won't, I, won't, I won't tell too many puns, but. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so, Where all did you grow? So I, I grew. Tomatoes, peppers, cucumbers, you name it, I grow it. <laughs> See, that's, and that's not easy. Like, a lot of people don't have a green thumb. Mm -hmm. I, I have two green thumbs. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. I'm sitting here looking at all the TV shows you've been on. You've been on the news, CNN, and Fox, and 
Everywhere. Everybody want to talk to you. Michelle Obama mentioning your name. What does this feel like? It feels amazing. Yeah. It's, it feels amazing. I, I'm just, my mind is blown. <laughs> <laughs> now, Mom, what is it like having a, a child prodigy that's taking over the ag agricultural world? Um, oh, that's, so, you know, we, j we jumped in head first. Right. Um, again, this was something that her great-grandmother was teaching all of us. She kind of ran with it. We was just like, mm, I don't uh, know about that. They, they didn't believe me. No, we didn't believe that it would grow. Like, if you put a collard green stem, basically, the base of it, in a pot, it'll regrow some collard greens. I was like, nah, I think we got to have some seeds, Grandma. You know, but um, it did happen. And how I feel about her just... Being in this space, I think, is wonderful because here you have a young black girl, you know, regardless of her being black. She's the youngest, period. Mm. Um, she's in a lane where she can teach other kids. She's in a lane where she's teaching other adults. Um, and it's, it's mind-blowing for her because it's going over her head. Mm. But for mom and dad, you know, we're just like, Dang, you know, like she really been doing <laughs> her resume is <laughs> off the chain. Look, it's like a whole before page, man. before you think, you think it ain't. It's a whole page. <laughs> before ten years old, right? You you met VP Kamala Harris, like handshake, have conversation. You know, you've been mentioning, you know, with um, uh, former first lady Michelle Obama. Like that right there is just like. I'm going to tell you what really got me, Carlos. Sesame Street. All Sesame, my oh, life, man. I wanted to be on Sesame Street. I that thought I was like, right. right so I'm just like, dang, baby, you doing it, you know? You really are. And, and, We're real proud of you. Yeah. <laughs> Nickelodeon and everything. Right. Now, I wanted to get some gardening tips from you because a lot of people are going to watch this. What tips can you give people on their gardening and how they can get some, some good tomatoes and good fruit going? So I would say get some soil, a pot, and a plant. Oh, and lots of sunlight and water. What is the easiest plant? Could you tell Mr. Carlos what's the easiest plant to grow for most people? Mm -hmm. The easiest plant to grow is a tomato plant. It's a tomato plant is very easy to grow because, you know, a, lo a lot of people don't know, but tomato plants can grow roots up the stem. Mm -hmm. They grow roots up the stem. Mm -hmm. And it only takes like three to four weeks, I mean, I mean a month, for it to grow. Mm. Now what's the easiest fruit to grow? I want some fruit. Mm. Well, mm, I hate not, to tell you. <laughs> not, there's not really probably blueberries. Yeah, pro probably a blueberry. Or strawberry. Yeah, there you go. yeah stra strawberries. Strawberries, the number one easiest fruit. Okay, that's where I'll start then. Yeah, I we need like... some strawberries. And, and maybe, oh. we can, um, maybe we can get Mr. Carlos started on his very first, you know, small garden. Yeah. You, you, She's you not okay good. With that? Maybe that's yes. impossible. Yeah. <laughs> yes, yes. Uh, I will get you started on your own little garden. Thank you. Yes. Now, see... You teach me how to farm, I'm going to be a farmer for life. <laughs> Absolutely. We, we were supposed to bring you a gift, uh, but we left it on the kitchen table. Somebody's going to eat it. Somebody's going <laughs> to eat it. Yeah, actually, actually, that would be true because the dogs, the, oh, I have the dogs. It's gone. It's gone. <laughs> it's yeah. well, gone. I don't think they're going to be, but we'll, we'll definitely uh, make sure that you get basket. you. Yeah, we'll, yeah, we'll, we'll send, send you a basket. Send me something to sit on the table for Thanksgiving. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Listen, we, and we're gonna get you some fresh honey. You like honey? Oh, absolutely. Yeah, I I have I have an apiary. Really? Yeah, I have an apiary. You're just gonna take over the whole food industry. <laughs> <honey. laughs> what advice would you give to some of the younger kids who might be watching this? Hmm. Some advice. Some advice. Well, I would say, I would say, get. Started on what you want 
of who you want or what you want to be. That's good advice. Mm -hmm. or, or just keep growing. See, the puns never stop. They, they don't. <laughs> now, you know we had to tell her that, you know, I was like, Miss Carlos is a comedian. And all throughout the house, you know, she likes to do these bee puns and excellent puns. <laughs> <laughs> so she said, if I don't, if you know, if farming don't work out, I'm going to be a comedian. <laughs> I, I can see a lot of similarities in that. <laughs> Yeah, she said she was going to be a comedian. But she has some questions for you. She you got okay. questions for me? So, I, so, one of my questions is, how did you get started being a comedian? Being a silly kid. Yeah. <laughs> coming up with my own puns and making people <laughs> laugh. That's how I started. It, very, it started when I was very young. I always used to make all the adults laugh, so i kind of always been a comedian. Mm -hmm. Yeah, um, I, I, think, I think that you and me have something in common. <laughs> okay. I think so. I think you might be a, you, you sharp, though. Yeah. Yeah. Believe it or not. <laughs> <laughs> I believe it. You believe it. I believe it. You believe it. I believe it, because I'm looking at your work. Your work speaks for itself. It, even if I didn't, everybody else already does. <laughs> you have been verified. <laughs> right. Three-year-old farming prodigy. Yes. How, often, how much time do y'all spend on average outside in the garden? So like well, an average, oh, go ahead. So my mom will usually stay inside. Mm -hmm. Me and dad go outside. <laughs> oh, OK. So usually her schedule, they wake up, they'll go spend a couple of hours in the morning time when the sun haven't hit yet. Mm. Um, it's hot, you know. Yeah, yeah. Once, uh, as time goes by, the sun gets to blazing. The Absolutely. sun gets to cooking. <laughs> so yeah, we, we kind of stick away from like that 11.30ish um, yeah. to maybe about like 3, 4 o'clock. So they'll do before but, 11, yeah. do after 5. Sometimes, sometimes me and my dad would take would take some breaks or something, or something like that. Mm. And, but once we're out there, we're we're focused on what we're doing. See, that's amazing, man. Y'all might have to write a book or something. Y'all, y'all probably raising the last okay. generation of hardworking kids. <laughs> And it's just, and it's like, it's a natural yeah. thing. It's not forced. And, yeah. and yeah. she just really has a knack for it. Yeah. That's amazing. Speaking of books, I have a book called I'm Growing Places. Another poem. I love it. Would you even bring me one? Uh, another, another fun? You want another fun from me? I'm going to have to get the book. You got to get the book, <laughs> yeah. So yeah, we, we, what are you I'm telling you, we had, we, had a, <laughs> we had some stuff for it. I'm talking about like from the T-shirt to the sustainable bag to the book. We had a, um, a jar of honey. I had pressed all this stuff up, and I was like, okay, y'all, we can't be late. Can't be late. Let's, let's go, let's go, let's go. We get our tails, <laughs> and I go, what's the bag? What's, what's the uh, contact? Because there's a lot of people who watch this show who are into the farming world, they be sending us all kind of stuff. And I know they gonna wanna connect with y'all and, and exchange goodies and things of that nature. What, what's the contact info? Where they can find you? So, they, if, so you can find me on my website on www.agriculture.com. You got a whole website. Mm -hmm. yeah. You handling big business. And you can follow me on on Instagram. Uh, go go to Ago Culture. A the word grow and culture with a K. Hey man, I think the kids gonna be all right. <laughs> the kids are gonna be okay. Yeah. What grade are you in now? I'm in fourth now. How's that going? Going pretty good. She's homeschooled. Yeah, I'm, I'm homeschooled. Yeah, because you're really too smart to be. Yeah, I'm, <laughs> I'm, I'm, yeah, I'm, 
I'm really, I'm really smart. I know. I can tell by the puns. <laughs> just to be able to even put that together, <laughs> that is a whole nother level of intelligence. Yeah. So, so I got I got the puns from 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 the from the show you're on. So so really. So when when me, when my parents watch watch when your when my parents watch your show and see you do all the puns and stuff, I like to sneak in and watch with them. Oh, okay. <laughs> see, I'm teaching. And then, and then I, I start making up my own puns, see? just like you did. Come on. <laughs> Go, <girl. laughs> what else do you like to do? What are, what are your other hobbies? Hmm. My other hobbies? Some, sometimes when my, my friends got their basketball out, I to do a little one-on-one. -on -one. Oh, okay. You got hoop skills too. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So there was this one time what, where we was at a like a outdoor event, and there was a basketball hoop thing. Oh, so, okay. <laughs> and and I was ridiculously good at it. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Let me find out. You're going to be hooping and farming. And what are you going to do in the winter when it's too cold to go outside and farm? Well, it, when it's too cold to go outside and farm, we we like to get some hot chocolate. Okay. <laughs> we, get to let, we get some hot chocolate. We, yeah. You know what? I, we, we, just, we just do everything. Okay. We vacation. Yeah, we vacation. <laughs> In the wintertime, we yeah. take a vacation. That's because that's the only time we're able to. When it's growing Slow down, season, yeah. you know, it's Emma? growing season. Um, she actually grows all the way up to Christmas. So January through March. What's in season right now? Um, we're 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 transforming over to all the brassicas. That's your collard greens, cabbage, kale. I'm so glad you told me because I ain't want to ask. <laughs> I was just gonna sit here and act like I oh yeah, this is brassica season. I'm just looking for some good brassica. <laughs> um, all of your rooted stuff, like your your onions, your beets, your carrots, your potatoes. Um, like right now, what we haven't pulled up are um, eggplant, um, butternut squash, pumpkins, you know, stuff like that you can kind of do. Pumpkins. I like how you just do it no, like I everybody got, got pumpkins. You yeah, know your pumpkins. You know, I, got some, I got some very big pumpkins. Like, like I have some pumpkins that are like this big, and there was one pumpkin that mm -hmm. like super huge. Yeah, super huge. That's dope. Yeah, and I also growing some watermelons. Yeah. Oh, I'm, I'm yeah, coming yeah. out. To, can I come out to the farm? Yeah, the watermelons are not quite ready. Okay. But. The pumpkins grew faster than I expected. <laughs> <laughs> She's killing me with the pumpkins. <laughs> well, I'm going to make sure everybody go to your website and support everything you got going on. It's so dope to see somebody your age have a passion for something like that and really just excel at it. We're so proud of you, baby girl. You got all the support in the world. Anything you want to leave them with today? That I want to leave, well, that I want to leave here with today. A pun from you. <laughs> well, we've come to the end. I guess we should just make it like eggs and beat it. <laughs> <laughs> Black market is open. The Johnson family is here with us today. You didn't think I had the pun for you. <laughs>